Next, I'm going to discuss about the try and method of this program. So if you debug the code, control comes to main function here after that coincide. So I have taken three integer array time variable. First is a double r. One. Second, a double r two. Third, a double r three. And next variable n one. N two. Sum. I and X. So I have C out function. So whatever in double quote that display into the output screen, enter the first array size, and whatever I'm going to enter, so that received by N1. So I'm going to enter N1 value for here after control comes to this point. C out. So this or display into the output screen, enter elements and for loop. So I have I value initialized to zero, and uh, check the condition zero less than n one. So n one value four. Condition is true, so that coincide. So I have a double r one of zero position. Let's enter new element. So I am going to enter three. Here after I increase, so I is now one. Or uh, check the condition one less than or four. Condition is true, so that coincide. So I have let's enter a double r. One of one person new element, so I'm going to enter six. Here after I increase, so I is two now. Or check the condition two less than n one value. Four condition is two, so that coincide. So let's enter eight or two person new element. So I'm going to enter seven. Here after I increase, so I is three now. Or check the condition three less than four. Condition is true, so let's enter add or three position new element. So I'm going to enter eleven. Here after I increase, so I is now four. That check the condition four less than four. Condition is not true, so that not going side. Now control comes to this point. So I do whatever in double quote that display into the output screen into the second array size and whatever I'm going to enter, so that is by n two. So I'm going to enter n two value three. Now here after control comes to this point. So I do see out. So this or uh, display into the output screen. Enter elements, and I value start from zero. Check the condition zero. Enter value three. Condition is two. So zero less than three. Condition is two. So let's go inside. So I do eight over two of zero position. Let's enter new element. So I'm going to enter eleven or twelve. Sorry. Here after I increase, so I is now one. Or check the condition one less than three. Condition is two. So let's enter a double or one person new element. So I'm going to enter sixteen. Here after I increase, so I is two now. Check the condition two less than n two value three. Condition is two. So that coincides. So let's enter a double or two or two person new element. So I'm going to enter seven. Now here after I increase, so I is now three. Or check the condition three less than three. Condition is not true, so that not going side. Now control comes to this point. So I have I value start from zero again. Or check the condition zero less than n one value four. Condition is true, so that going side. So I have a double or one of zero position. So let's so do indexing. So this is a zero index. One, two, three, and here also. This is a zero index. One, two. So I do a double or one of zero position. So zero position is three is the so three go to a double or three of zero position. Three of zero position. 
uh, that come three. Now here after I increase, so I is now one. Or check the condition one less than or four condition is two, so that coincide. So at a double or one of one position or six is there, so six move to eight or three of one. So six comes to eight or three of one. I increase, so I is now two. Or check the condition two less than four condition is two, so that coincide. So at a double or one or two. So one or two seven is there. Seven move to move to a double or three of two. So three of two that comes seven. Here after I increase, so I is now three. Or check the condition three less than n one value. Four condition is two, so that coincides. So at a a double or one of three. So one of three eleven is there. Eleven move to a double or Three of three. So three of three. Eleven come. Now here after I increase, so I is four now. Or check the condition four less than n one value. Four condition is not true, so that not coincide. Now control comes to this point. So I do sum equal to n one plus n two. So n one value four, n two value three. So four plus or three sum become seven. Now here after control comes to for loop, I value start from zero. Or uh, n one value go to x, so n one value four that go to x, so x become four. And here after check the condition x less than sum, so x value is now four, four less than seven. So condition is true. And here i less than n two, so i value zero, n two value three. So zero less than or three condition is true. So both condition is true. So that coincides. So at here, a double or two of i value is zero. So a double or two of zero. So twelve is the so twelve go to a double or three x value is now four. So a double or three of four position. So this is a four index. So a double or or two of zero position value go move to a double or three of four. So twelve comes to this point. Here after that go up and increase the value of x. So x is five now. And here after I increase so i is one. Check the condition x less than sum. So five less than some value seven condition is two. So this condition is two and i less than n two. So one less than three condition is two. So that coincides. So at a a or two of one position. Two of one position sixteen is there. Sixteen move to a or three of five position. So this is a five index. So sixteen now. Here after x increase, so x is now six. And I increase, so I is now two. Check the condition. X less than sum, so six less than sum value seven. Condition is two, and I less than n two, so I value is two. N two value three. Two less than three. Condition is two, so that coincides. So here, a double or two of I points. So a double or two of two. So two of two seven is there. Seven over two a double or three of X value six. A double zero six position. So this is six index. Item seven come. Now here after that increase the value of x. So x is now seven. And increase the value of i. So i is now three. Check the condition. Seven less than seven condition is false. And Three less than three. I value is three. N two value three. Three less than three. Condition is false. So both condition is not true. So that not coincide. Now control comes to this point. So I do. Or see out function. So this or display into the output screen. And I value start from zero. Or check the condition zero less than n some value seven. Condition is true. So that coincide. So I do. See out. 
So 8 over 3 of 0 position, the value is 3. So 3 display and all if 8 character space. I increase, so I is no 1. Check the condition 1 less than 7 condition is true. So that coincides. So I have 8, the 8 over 3 of 1 position. Or 6 is there. 6 uh, display, leave 8 character. I is increase, so I is 2 now. Check the condition 2 less than some value 7 condition is true. So that coincides. So 8 over 3 of 2 position, 7 is there. 7 display and leave 8 character space. Here after I increase, so I is now 3. Or check the condition 3 less than some condition is true. So that coincides. So I have 8 over 3 of 3 position. So 3 of 3 position 11 is there. So 11 print and leave 8 character space. I increase size for now. Check the condition for less than 7 condition is true. So that coincides. So I have 8 over 3 of 4 position. So 8 over 3 of position. 4 position is 12 is there. 12 display and leave 8 character space. Here after I is increase. So I is 5 now. Check the condition 5 less than 7 condition is true. So that coincides. So at 8 over 5 position, 16 is the 16 display and leave 8 character space. Here after I increase so I 6 now, check the condition 6 less than 7 condition is true. So that coincide 8 over 3 of 6 position, 3 of 6 position, 7 is the 7 display and leave 8 character space. Here after I increase so I is now 7. Check the condition 7 less than 7, some value 7 condition is not true. So that or from so I do, I enter this two array and after merging this array, this is all I made display. So this is the trial method of this program. So I hope guys you understand. So thanks for watching. See you next week.